Now it's time for chairperson's remark. Uh, it's Professor Dr. Nabil Hassan Rana, sir. Please. Uh. Thank you very much, uh, all the speakers. And uh, in this uh, early misty weather of this uh, uh, early morning, of the last day of the year, uh, we enjoyed the session very much. And, and uh, it started with the debate, and uh, which has warmed up us. Because uh, whenever any speaker was uh, telling, and uh, uh, my thinking was that, oh yes, I am in favor of, favor of this. And uh, it was so nice. So whenever we uh, uh, learn about the use of steroid in drug-induced acute interstitial nephritis, I was thinking that, yes, this is very logical, and we should use uh, steroid in a drug-induced acute interstitial nephritis. But when we uh, uh, hear from the opposition, the, we think that, now nah, we should be very much uh, logical. And uh, actually, uh, my conclusion is that the, each patient should be individualized. And we at the clinician should be the best judge to use a steroid. Uh, and uh, we should, uh, most important is that prevention is most important than cure. So we should be careful. With, uh, we should not have any drug-induced interstitial nephritis. And preventive measures should be taken first. And then, whenever possible, we should do the kidney biopsy. Then. Uh, seeing the level of fibrosis, then we should go for using the steroid. We should not expose the patient for unnecessary side effects. And uh, about the second speaker, the use of immunosuppressive in unexplained uh, GN, where renal biopsy is not possible. So yes, this is also the same thing that we should be very much uh, rational in using the immunosuppressive drug because we know that a lot of side effects of the immunosuppressives. And about the SGLT2 inhibitors, yes, this is a novel drug. Initially, it was a diabetic drug, but later on it came up as a cardiac drug, and now it is a renal drug, actually, because a lot of benefits of using SGLT2 inhibitors, and uh, time will say how much benefit it will give to us. Uh, as the time is constrained, I'll hand over the mic to Professor Shami. Thank you, Professor Rana. Uh, thank you very much. I must thank to Brigadier General Mamus Prasivi for inviting us in a nice morning. And also there is a Brigadier General Moshin here. He's a new director and all the senior nephrologists and colleagues. Excellent presentation by everybody. And this is a short of time. I'll not say anything. I would like to be a senior nephrologist. I joined the assistant professor to join the club. I would like to be a tendency to give more time, more lectures. But Professor Moti Raman Shab and Haru Shab said that you must maintain the time. Even if you go in the foreign country, I would like to be a senior nephrologist. 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 But they finish in time. And this is the secret. सेक्टर आमी बोले दिच्छी, you must do practice at home। तो मैं आमी अखनो कोरी, आमी अखनो आमी लेक्चर दौर आगे पाँच छः बार I try, अमार कतुटुक लेक्चर बोल बो कतुटे पासा चेस्टा करता होगे। पाँच मिनट होले पाँच मिनट, दस मिनट ऐटे चेस्टा करता है, इटा not जाई, this message has to be given to young nephrologist। ऐकने सबाई को भी भालो करते, but I must appreciate at the contents point for the first speaker, he has done rightly, and other speaker as well, but first speaker के contents का भालो चिलो, and excellent सबाई भलो कर जिन एक पॉइंट बोलो एक जन बोलते जी एन फर्टी फाइव पार्सेंट डायबिटीज नाइनटीन पार्सेंट हि शुड नो ह्वाट इज दिविलेंस अफ जी एन एंड डायबिटीज नाउ डायबिटीज द फार्स कज अफ ट्रनिक्लोमोनाफ्राइट इज वन एनदार पार्सन लुपास नेफ्राइट इज क्लस टू एंड यू नो द क्लस फाइव क्लसेस टू एंड वन टू थे बट थार्ड थ्री थार्ड एंड फोर्थ यू मास्ट डू दैपी इज ए फोकल प्रोलिफेट एंड डिफेंस प्रोलिफेट Nephrit, you must do the biopsy. Without biopsy, you cannot give the drug. And there are new plus. Uh, you should know. Another thing I should say: HGL2 T inhibitor is an excellent drug. It is a renoprotective, cardioprotective, and other effects. And initially, it was said it is a drug of diabetes. Then rightly says it says it is a drug of endocrinology. But whatever might be, it works for the kidney. So it is a drug of nephrology. Thank you very much.
Good morning and assalamu alaikum to everyone. First of all, welcome to this national conference 2022 and also welcome to pediatric nephrology session. Uh, na next few, next one hour, uh, there will be two sessions of pediatric nephrology and I, uh, I would like to uh, th thank you first Dr. Mamon Mustafi sir to give us the opportunity to present here. This uh, first session will be chaired by Professor Mohammad Hanif. Uh, she is the ex-professor and head of the department of Bangladesh Shisho Hospital and Institute. And uh, next chairperson, Dr. Habibur Rahman, Professor Habibur Rahman sir, he is the ex-professor and chairman of pediatric nephrology, Bangabandhu Sheikh Moji Medical University. And this session, there is a two speaker. First speaker, Dr. Professor Afruza Begum, madam. Uh, she is a professor and chairman of pediatric nephrology, Bangabandhu Sheikh Moji Medical University. And next presenter, Dr. Abdul Kader. She, he is the associate consultant, pediatric nephrology, Square Hospital. Uh, 